all right hello and welcome to the video guys so i recently started my twitch channel as i told you guys about um there were a few things that i had to get used to and change but i'm finally back from streaming after three days this is like my first recording after doing three streams so kind of getting used to uh just doing the standard recordings again um we're gonna be on here, here we go again with this thing man i'll just leave it like that um we're gonna be on pearl river and this is in the t71 da now i've been playing this vehicle for a couple weeks now i really 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 like this tank guys it's very powerful um it has a six round clip at tier seven and yeah this is uh, being on Pearl River, like this, you know, this is going to be a decent game because Pearl River is a pretty good um, map for light tanks. And the best thing you could do in a, a tank with a clip like this is spot people crossing in the middle, of, you know, of the open. So this is going to be a good start here. And then we get the VK 2801 um, 105. And we're going to put a couple shot, or just one into him. And it looks like I kind of try and snapshot the M4 or just quickly shoot him. And I get that shot. So we're at 606 damage, 889 assist. Now, if you want to check out my Twitch channel, by the way, just go to my main page on YouTube and you'll see a link for it kind of at the top right where that banner image is. You will see it there. Um, I have one more video that I'm going to post on YouTube directly from my Twitch channel. I exported it from Twitch. I clipped it and did all that. And I'm going to export that directly to um, YouTube and you will see that as well and that was also on Pearl River. They are both masteries so it just so happens that my masteries are apparently on Pearl River in the T71 DA but that game was insane man. This is a really good game but it was one of those games where we just kind of rolled the enemy team. Um, that game is one that I carried I believe it came down to a 1v4 if you include the arty at the end there or no I'm sorry 1v5. Um, if you include the arty and i ended up carrying the game so it was phenomenal i will post that um up probably after this one but um we're trying to mark this thing i looks like i'm about about 89 percent here i think right now i am around 89 percent on the mark after today's um you know, little session that I had. I streamed for about an hour and a half, and a couple of people were in there on Christmas. You know, it was fantastic. Um, so I'm probably going to post this tomorrow, but I hope you ha you guys had a fantastic Christmas. If I do post it today or tonight, I hope you are having a phenomenal Christmas and, you know, enjoying the time with your family. But in the meantime, I figured I can give you some T71 DA. So yeah, we're just kind of stomping this team. It's 800 damage and 1263 assist is what we're at now. And we're already at like 5800 5, W and 8, which is just insane, man. Like it's very easy to pad stats in this vehicle if you so choose, right? Um, so yeah, just keep that in mind. Like this tank, like if you're good at light tanks, man, you're gonna, you're gonna pad your W and 8. Um, we're at two kills and yeah, I mean, there's nothing, like, super important to note about this video, I, but it was a mastery, so I figured I would just show you guys. In the meantime, I'm going to try and get this back to the full view. Let's see if it'll happen, guys. I don't know. You see how it just doesn't, like, stay on that one? I don't know why. It's so weird, man. But in any case, guys, um, this game's closing. Like... like this game is kind of coming to a close. It's 14 to 3, and at this point, I'm just going to YOLO the AMX. So, here, um, enjoy this ending to this game right here. We're going to ram this guy. I think he might have went like AFK or something. I don't know. Looks like it. And yeah, we clean him up. 2637 damage, 2298 assist, and that was a mastery. 10k um, W and 8. We got above 90% on the mark here, but it did go down a little bit again after this. I think we're at like the, in like the high 89s or something like that. And yeah, I spammed quite a bit of heat, but it is what it is. So let's take a look at the end plates, guys. Um, Again, nothing like strategic about this. We just stomped this team, right? I just figured I would show you guys because this was a mastery. Um, I, you know, any mastery that I get in a tank that I've been playing a lot of, I'm going to show you guys. So here it was a mastery, 2298, 2637. And um, yeah, man, this tank is just really, really, really powerful. Um, when, you, when you can use that six round clip to your advantage and, and dish out some 900 damage in a matter of, I don't know, 10 seconds or whatever, it's pretty insane. So we were taught by experience um, it looks like top by damage and we had four, like we're top by everything here, right? We have four kills and 
yeah, we lost quite a bit from shooting the um, the gold rounds, unfortunately. I didn't need the gold rounds. I just kept them loaded for whatever reason. I Sometimes I forget. Like, I'll just click on it and I'll freaking forget, man, that I even have them loaded. Battle duration, four minutes and five seconds. I think that's pretty standard for <laughs> the holiday ops matchmaking. And at the time, I had 97 battles, 55% win rate, and 1131 damage in this tank. After today, I think this the damage went up maybe a little bit like we had a good session on the stream man with the t71 dial we had one bad game on fisherman's bay but we spawned the south side and i just hate the south on fisherman's bay man i feel like it's kind of bs but if you guys are new here I, i've gotten some new subscribers recently i think probably because of twitch and stuff but if you're new here i'll show you how i have this thing set up i play a lot of light tanks by the way um we're looking at 0.35 dispersion 1.93 gaming time the dpm isn't crazy but um with this vehicle you know you're using the clip so the dpm isn't really all that important i do have good concealment unfortunately that's not showing here and yeah how i have this thing set up is with optics in the scouting slot and this is the only vehicle that i run two pieces of bounty or special equipment on i run the bounty exhaust and the bounty turbo and the turbo really really helps to get this thing to maneuver like this like you can like sneak around in it you know what i mean weave in and weave out it's very very helpful when you're trying to get away and the dock can do that very very, very well it's it traverses like crazy like it literally goes like this like you can you can meander your way around and dodge shells very very easily so it's a very fun tank to play um and the six round clip just makes it even that much more fun um situational awareness concealment recon here and then we have snapshot smooth ride concealment concealment um and then i run it with intuition and i also have the um the little what is this called i forget for it makes it makes it so that you it's it actually might be the one for traverse it's either the one that makes you traverse faster or the ground resistance one so that you can go a little faster i think at this point i switched this up to run brothers in arms i could be wrong but i think i switched it up to brothers in arms now um, but if not i will be doing that soon because i'm almost at 100 percent on this third skill um, for the crew so that's it guys um, that's the t71 da um, again be prepared for a video that uh, I exported over from Twitch, um, and you will see that as well. That is a phenomenal game, and I want you guys to see it live as I was playing it. It's going to be in 1080, not 1440. The quality might not be quite as good, but I really want you guys to see it as I was playing it live because it is thrilling. All right, that's it, guys. I'll catch you for the next one. Take care, and bye-bye now.